What's up guys? So I'm in the middle of creating a checklist and updating my website and social media and all that stuff. And I noticed that I needed some updated pictures of myself working. So I'm about to take those pictures right now. First things first though, I probably need to get changed. I mean, I love my logo t-shirt. Shout out Go Customs. That's my brother's company. He made this t-shirt. But I need to go ahead and change it to something a little more professional, presentable. So let me put you guys down and we will get to that. All right, that's a little bit better. I think the shirt works. So now I need to set all this stuff up and then we'll get started taking some pictures. Now that all of that stuff is set up, basically it's time to frame my shot. I am going to be shooting into this corner, mainly because I like the white wall. I like this window light and I have the flash set up, but that's mainly for fill. I really don't want to use it as a main source of light, but I might have to use it as a main source of light in the off chance that uh, I'm not digging this window light. Just to give you guys a tour of my setup, what I'm working with, shooting with the Sony a7 III. This is a Tamron 35 millimeter lens, f2.8. And like I said, at first I'm using window light as my main source um, my laptop is my prop. And then on top of the camera, we have my flash trigger. It's Godox 1X and it will be triggering the Godox TT600 flash. Um, and this is just a newer softbox. Also, one of the last things I should mention before I get started is that I will be using the Sony Imaging Edge app to control my camera with my phone and uh, hopefully my phone will be out of shot. Now it's time to get started. I took that first shot and honestly, I don't think I need the flash. So I'm actually gonna shoot without it, which I hope will make this a lot faster. There's also one more thing that I think would make this shoot uh, just a little bit better, and that is a prop. So let me go get that. Today's props, we are using iPad and my Sony a6500. I really want these photos to look and have the feel like I'm actually working. And so I think things beside my computer would actually help produce that illusion. I'm really digging the pictures that I have, but now I think I want to get just a little closer. And so I'm going to switch lenses from the 35 to the 50. LOL guys, I thought that I was taking pictures with the 35. Turns out I've actually been taking pictures with the 24. So now let's see what the 35 looks like on this. Looking at the back of the camera, I can already tell that that's a tighter field of view and that's kind of more of what I was looking for. That field of view is actually a lot better. It's exactly kind of what I wanted. And I actually like this, like a clean backdrop. Might start recording videos in the kitchen. Let's change the focus mode of the camera because it's on spot focus, and I think it's missing focus.
I think I'm actually gonna close these. When the sun was behind the cloud, I really didn't mind it, but now that it's creating these lines, it's not really the look I'm going for. It is a vibe, but it's not the vibe that I'm looking for, so I'm gonna change things up a little bit. I would say that actually looks pretty good. I know that I'm really far away from the camera and the audio on this clip is probably gonna be crap and I'm super dark. But on this camera, you got, on that camera, on these pictures, you guys will be able to see. One of the last sets of pictures that I really want to try to get are just close-ups of the materials that I work with. I'll still be sitting back there taking the pictures, but I really want to try to get some close-ups. I have some from a different photo shoot and I really like those, so I'm going to try to recreate them here. Pretty sure I got what I wanted. I'll also leave a link in the description for you guys to download some of the pictures, you know, without me really being the main focus. So in case you guys are looking for stock photography, you can go ahead and check those out, download them, use them um, however you see fit. And that's all I got for this week. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. Leave a comment down below. Tell me what your favorite part was. Give me an idea on different photos I should take. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank you.